Sorry it took me a couple of days to get to this comment, but I just wanted to wait until I clean my ears to do this. I just cleaned this ear, and as you can tell, it is a little bit red. This ear is my problem ear, so you may have one of your ears that is a little bit easier to get jewelry in than the other. So we're just going to try on this ear. So let me take this out. Okay, so first things first, you really want to make sure that your ear and jewelry is lubricated with your lubrication of choice, whether that be oil or a balm. So I just took some of my balm and I am rubbing it on the jewelry. Also, you will notice that there is one side where it is just a smidgen smaller. Now, it's not going to be that much of a difference, but you want to make sure that that side goes in your ear. So for mine, it would be this side right here. I'm not sure if you can tell, but this side is a lot more rounded than this side. So this side will be a lot easier to get in. Now, since I've been doing this for a while, this process is probably going to go pretty quickly for me. Now, the best way I can describe it is just to put one corner of the plug in. And you may have to maneuver your skin around it, but it just goes in. Now again, like I said, if you have a problem ear like I do, it will take quite a bit more um, maneuvering and stuff just to get it in and to get it out. But the more that you take them in and out to clean them and stuff, your ears will start to get used to that and they'll kind of stretch out a bit over time and you'll be able to get them in and out no problem. I wish there was a better way I could show you, but I'm going to do it again just for good measure. So one edge of the plug goes in and you just kind of push down and push your ear skin around it if need be. Um, sometimes it can just go in without having to move any of the skin around, but yeah, <laughs> I hope that helped.